Afternoon guys, um, today I reached my PB, my personal best in Beverly. Um, I'll show you the figures in a moment. Um, I've just finished for the day. Uh, it was 10, between 10 and 11 degrees when I started this morning and it's now up on 24. Um, I've stayed out an extra, an extra hour. Um, I was gonna try and stay out, but I'd have to stay out till eight o'clock at night at this rate. Um, I need to sleep at some point. Um, point I wanted to make is, um, I've actually just done, which I'll show you in a moment, 96 miles, give or take, and I've got 75 miles left on the gun, 44% left on the battery. Um, this confirms this is a real world 170 mile range vehicle in the summer months at least um i've got no doubt that that would not do 170 according to uh james uh lemon tea who has uh, who has a uh, lease by pro which i haven't got yet i'm due to get one soon because i need that for when i do my uh 10k uh test which is coming in the next couple of months or so um there's actually about three to five kilowatts left even when it goes dash 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 um on these figures like i say so that's going to be 180 miles but i'd say real world 170 miles um on this vehicle now my personal best which is the whole point of this video is that i actually reached 4.8 kilowatts uh per mile um sorry 4.8 miles per kilowatt my bad um and as i say i'll show you those in a moment but the point I want to make is this is in working conditions. Like my taxi test, this is not me on my own hypermiling. This is me driving the car. I even um, hammered it um, on two or three occasions this morning um, just to have a bit of fun. I was going through some country lanes. And so I possibly, without that, could have quite easily have got up to 4.9 uh, miles per kilowatt hour, which would have been absolutely phenomenal. But anyway, guys, I hope you're having a good afternoon and I'll speak to you guys soon. Bye for now.